Uh, hello guys in this tutorial we will be talking about that how to work with the csv files in python using the csv module and we will be also be looking at the pandas library this is the name of the library in order to work with csv files how to read the data inside it you can see that i have a example file data.csv file inside this there is some data out there we will be looking that looking that how to read this data inside our python application and how to create a new csv file so i have app.py a blank python file so just create this file here and we will be needing the csv module here so you just need to import the csv module so it is a built-in python module in order to process csv files in order to open this file we can just use with open the open function and inside this we can just provide the path so this is present inside my root directory so i can just pass here data.csv and then i just need to write here uh, pass a mode here so just put a comma here and after that inside this you just need to write rt so this stands for read and uh, here we just need to write uh, as f and inside this we just need to make a data variable and we just need to use the csv.reader function so this will actually read the file and after that we just need to print it so we will use make use of for loop for row in data and we will print the row that's it so if i just run this application on the terminal you will see that guys it is printing out all the lines which are present which are present in this file it is data.csv so on the first line you are saying that in the square brackets programming language designed by appeared extension so currently there are four lines and four lines are returned here you can you can even print this uh, as a dictionary also so if i just delete this and if i just want to open this as a dictionary so i can just use a method which is csv dot uh, dictionary reader so this is a method inside this you just need to provide the open method again and uh, my file is data.csv and in this manner we will use uh, for raw and reader a simple for loop and we can just print out the our rows so print raw that's it so in this way you can print out as a dictionary so if i run this you will see that now it is printing it in as a dictionary you will see that these parentheses are there so this is like a dictionary in python so this is the reading part of csv now we will see that how to create a new csv file in python so for that we will be uh, again be using with open again and inside this you just need to name your target file let's suppose i want to make a new file so i will write here new.csv so this is the name of the file and then you just need to provide a mode here so the mode will be w w stands for write and then you just need to write as file and we just need to create a writer variable here and we will use the writer method of csv module and we will provide our file comma we will provide a delimiter property so this is a property that we need to write here delimiter is equal to and here you can just provide any symbol of your choice but i will provide comma and the next property guys is quote char quote character and uh, this you also can initialize it to any value but i will be initializing it to double quotes and comma the last property is quoting so just write this property also and this is equal to csv dot quote minimal so just initialize this <coughs> and now inside this we just need to write our rows so for writing this we can just use a method which is write row so inside this we can just pass our rows here so in square brackets you can just write any value let's suppose programming i write and let's suppose i again write some random values so this is the first row and uh, in order to insert more rows you can just copy this and paste it let's suppose four times more 
and now if I run this you will see that it will create this file so you will see that new.csv is created if I open this file there is a problem here code character must be set if coding enabled let me just see guys I have made a problem here so code character I think that this should go in double in single quotes so just put a single quotes here and then you just insert your symbol and now if I run this again if I open this you will see that all the entries are there so just make sure that you put a single quote and then inside those single quotes you put your double quotes so this will create a new CSV file for us which contains four rows so in this basic manner you can just use the built-in python module which is csv in order to read and write files csv files and now we will be looking at a library which is called as pandas so now in order to install this library you can just uh, make this command that is pip install pandas so this will install your library i have already installed this so you can see that requirement already satisfied so now in order first of all in order to work it you just need to import it so that we're at the very top import pandas and now we just need to read the file so we will make a new result variable and there is a method which is read csv this is a method which is there inside this library and here you just need to write our file which is data.csv and you can just print out the result which is very easy so in one line of code you are write, uh, reading our csv file so if i run this again you can see that guys all the entries are printed out zeroth index you can see that python so if i open this file you will see that programming language designed by appeared extension this is again python you can see that in this way you can just read it read your csv file using pandas and now if in order to create a new uh, csv file you can just uh, import a new library which is from pandas you just need to import data frame so this is uh, you need to write it so after that you can just make a variable so inside this you can just put a double curly bracket so inside this you can just write anything of your choice programming language and after that you can just provide an array here array of values in single quotes so in this way you can just write any values of your choice so in order to repeat this you just need to put a comma here <coughs> Put a comma and or to have new value we can just write here on the second line let's suppose I have language so this will contain another array which will have some more values put a comma again let's suppose I have the third property here which is again an array So now it, it contains three rows you can see that this is a first row second row third row and now we just need to create it so in order to create it we will use our data frame so data frame so inside this we will pass first of all our columns and uh, then we will provide a columns value which will be in this case will be programming so these are the columns which is presently on the left side so I will write these language and uh, third after providing this we just need to export our CSV file so I can just write here export CSV this is a variable and I can just use a method DFT to CSV so inside this we can just name our file here let's suppose I name this file as pandas.csv put a comma here and then you just need to initialize the index to none and header to true 
that's it so lastly you can just print out the values just print df here and now if i run this Just wait, it will take some time here. It is saying that line 8. On line 8, we have a problem here. So let me just see what is the problem. 